Hello with live primary election coverage from the WTIU newsroom. I'm Joe Wren. Well, incumbent Mayor Mark Cruzan has extended his lead and will take the Democratic primary from John Hamilton. And we have Mark Cruzan right now celebrating his victory at the Democratic headquarters downtown. Mr. Cruzan, are you there? I sure am. Tell us a little bit about your campaign strategy and why it worked. You know, I think it was a twofold strategy. One was to talk about the accomplishments that we've had, but also to make it very clear we are not resting on our laurels, that we've got ideas to move forward into you the next four years. And Mark, 41% of the voters did cast their ballot for Hamilton. What's your message to those residents? Well, I want them to know that the very first phone call I received of congratulations was from John, which is you know extremely uh, sincerely appreciated thing and uh, that he offered his support for the fall. Uh, I certainly appreciate that and uh, I, you know, I think for the most part those are people who feel as strongly about um, Wilmington as I do and uh, there may be some differences in opinion but I think for the most part we're going to find common ground and uh, I, I know we'll, we'll be extending uh, a hand of both appreciation for the campaign they've run but also uh, hopefully cooperation to move forward as one as uh, we think this city has been well served by the Democratic Party for many years and we want to continue to do that. So Mark, now what's your plan of attack tomorrow? Well, you know, it's a twofold one. Actually, it's one to thank our, our uh, volunteers and supporters and to collect yard signs. And, uh, and then, and I literally said this when I first ran, and that is that uh, good government is the best politics. So tomorrow we start working on our, our city budget. Uh, that's coming up. We have a meeting next week with the city council as a budget preview, and that's going to be laying the framework for, for 2012, uh, but also it starts to lay the framework for November. I mean, this is not the election. This is the nominating process, and we've got six more months to go before we know who's going to be the next mayor for certain. Thank you, Mark. Thank you.